Hello everyone, today I'm going to be teaching you how to add double jumping into your game. So the first thing we need to do is go to starter character scripts and starter player and then we're going to create a local script and we're just going to name this double jump. So the first thing we need to do is get user input service. I'm going to shorten it to UIS, so local UIS equals game get, serv get service user input service and then the next thing we need to do is get our character so local character equal, equal script.parent and in case you don't know uh, you can just set script.parent as your character and start a character scripts and it will just automatically set that to your character and then now we can get a humanoid so local humanoid equals character dot, dot humanoid now we're going to track how many times the player has jumped before landing so we can create a variable called jumps and set that to zero and then we need to have a max amount of times they can jump before landing so we can say local max jumps is equal to two so they can only jump twice before landing and now we need to create a tick called jump ticks or jump tick equals tick i'll explain what this does later and now we need to create a event called cumulate.state changed uh, connect function old new and old is just the previous state and new is the current state so if our current state or new is equal to enum dot humanoid state type dot landed then we can set jumps to zero because that because we know that our player has landed so we can reset the amount of jumps they've done and now we can do uis or user input service dot jump request connect function First, we need to make sure if they're allowed to double jump. So if jumps is less than max jumps. And then what we need to do is we need to have an interval where they cannot double jump. Because for some reason, Roblox calls this event multiple times at once when you're just trying to jump once. So we need to have like a short interval to only call this function only once. Uh, so we can do and tick minus jump tick is greater than zero is greater than 0.2 so now we can uh, reset jump tick we can increase jumps by one and now we can call the function humanoid change state and um, dot humanoid state type dot jumping so now we should be able to double jump so if we go ahead and test this as you can see if I jump once it's fine and now I can jump twice as well however I cannot jump three times at once so as you can see I'm trying to jump as many times as I can but it will only let me double jump and we can actually increase this we can increase max jumps to whatever you like so if we want to triple jumps then we can do that and we can now we can be able, we can jump three times before landing but not four times so anyways I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you learned something new today and I'll see you in the next video